Hello, I've just built a little rebel amp. I wanted an amp for uh, in my living room to uh, to practice or play and have fun. And I had an old uh, Sun amplifier, which is basically a Fender amplifier, but the speaker was gone and the amp was making uh, an awful noise. So I put in a Jensen speaker the Jensen CAR8 and I built the amp. So let's start off with some sound clips of the amp with the Jensen speaker.
first played the amp I thought it was a bit harsh the and the clipping especially of humbuckers is uh, is a bit too soon for my taste uh, I knew it would be a, a rock amp or an overdriven type amp uh, but I hope to get some nice clean tones out of it and the edge of the clean tones is a bit r too rough for me. I read about one guy who removed the LEDs from the circuit. There is a, after the preamp there is a, a clipping circuit it's just two LEDs, two LEDs uh, going from the signal to ground so they cut off some of the signal. He removed them and said it was sounding nice. So here we are you can see the two LEDs which will uh, clip the signal if it comes above a certain threshold and here is the socket I told, uh, told you about. Um, I had my wires connected to this side and it didn't work. Then I put it to this side and then it worked. The um, focus, come on, yeah. There's the jumper for the uh, power switch. And here are a few jumpers you don't want to forget. One, two, three, and then four. And if you don't want to connect a uh, effects loop, which I have, but I need to um, <laughs> need to finish it. I want to get it into the wooden back of the amp. Um, then you need to jumper between the send and return and. One other thing, I've grounded the chassis. If you run the amp on a, on a, a pedal power supply, 9 volt, uh, and you use single coil, you probably hear some buzzing and stuff when you uh, when you when your 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 connection to the strings or the guitar it loses connection with your body and you put your hands on, on, on strings or the bridge or anything you can hear a little bit of buzzing. That's because of the uh, cabinet is not grounded and your power supply is not grounded so you get a little bit of me 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 me. So let's listen to the same amp without the LA LED clipping uh, thingies.
So I think it sounded a bit better than before. So with without the LEDs, I think it's 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 sounding better. Um, especially with humbuckers, you couldn't get a clean sound, and now you can get kind of a clean sound out of it. Uh, and the overdriven sound is uh, mellower. So there's no no hard clipping. I like it. A lot of uh, cheap practice amps don't sound well. They sound terrible, 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 terrible. And this amp sounds good. Probably that's much to do with the speaker that's in it. But the circuit is uh, it's just right. It works and there's nothing funny or funky about it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, video and maybe see you later. Bye!